Frankie, you're a good guy. I've been doing this for a long time. Um, I respect you. But you have something that I want, and I want it tonight, here in my hometown. He's doing a sight of that, you know, this is a song that I own, dance with, and then, you know, pop the streets here. Oh, yeah. You know, I'm going to give you respect, bro, you know, but in this championship, bro, in this handbrake, he like the way he like the line of his attitude, which is... That's what he do. This is where... Do I look like the light like, way? I got him now! Not crazy, bro, it's short time. down here, but Aramis La Paz and Cha-Cha Charlie helping out their buddies Merengue and Diablo. Well, not quite, Vinny. Well, Team Shazam on the losing end of this one. What are they doing, walking back and forth, walking behind us for some reason? Get out of here. What is wrong with you guys? All right, hurry up before ICE comes and gets you throwing garbage at them. But the rightful winners, the plantain players, and look at this, Cha-Cha and Frankie, you all saw the altercation they had earlier. What's going on here? Cha-Cha wants to dance, and Frankie Flo with a full Nelson suplex! Takes Cha-Cha out. Well, that's revenge for what he did earlier when Cha-Cha attacked him with the backstabber. These two men will wrestle later on tonight for the LAW World Heavyweight Championship. We've got the main event coming up. It's Cha-Cha Charlie char challenging for that belt against Frankie Flo, the champion. We spoke to Cha-Cha Charlie earlier. Let's hear what he had to say. Well, Frankie has a long time wrestling. He's a veteran and I give him all the respect, but when you, know, you come at me, talking about my boots, talking about nonsense that shouldn't have been even mentioned, guess what? I'm going to have to do what I have to do. And uh, I hope you, you got the point, Frankie. I know everybody else got the point. Tonight is going down. Heavyweight title match in my backyard of Washington Heights. It's Tata time. Let's go. God. Oh no, again. Oh, come on. Oh. Oh. 
Ladies and gentlemen, this is Cha Cha Charlie. Uh, dancing, running. Is that how you run from ICE? Oh, come on. Come on. What are you, Superman? I believe I can fly. I believe I can touch the sky. My name is Hatcha Charlie. And I'm gonna dance with. Alright. You can stop twerking. Alright. Oh no, I don't like the sound of this. Oh, I've heard it enough. Come on. Oh no. Oh. Oh. Another disco. Come on. There he is, ladies and gentlemen, looking to defend his LAW World Heavyweight Championship title, Frankie Flo. Oh. I don't think Bruno Mars would be happy. Well, why not, Vinny? Wouldn't he be happy to see Frankie Flo? Oh, uh, I don't know. You know what would be happy? You know what would make me happy? To start seeing them dancing. Well, I don't know why you hate dancing so much, Vinny. We're in the ring, that's why. We're in the ring. Studio. In the ring where real men compete, and we've got some real men here tonight for LAW. Frankie Flo and Cha Cha Charlie. I feel like I'm watching that movie with Patrick Swayze, uh, Sleep With Me Baby, A Baby Put Baby in the Corner. What movie was that? I think that was Dirty Dancing. Yeah, Dirty Dancing. This is actually the dirtiest of dancing. Yeah. Nobody puts Vinny in the corner. Hey, I don't know how to take that, but that could be in many ways. Well, maybe you should go in the corner because you're a dunce. And you hey! Could, and you could wear a dunce cap and the teacher can give you detention because you're such an idiot. You're hurting my feelings now. I have feelings. Yeah, your feelings are the feelings of sadistic pain and insanity. Um, that's another guy, no, his name is Brodus. Well, Frankie Flo, ready to defend that belt. Master G holds it up high, the championship, which is the best title in our business. Well, here it is, ladies and gentlemen, right out in front of us, the richest prize in our sport. And this one is official. The main event here tonight for legendary action wrestling, La Guerra Kiskiania. Frankie Flo versus Cha Cha Charlie. Once again, I am the ace Dante Jace, along with Finny Badaboom, as always. We're very happy to be here in Inwood, New York. We've got Picture Disc Media. David Nambelasaka is the producer. And look at the power of Frankie Flo. You know, I have to admit, you know, I have to give Charlie credit. Look, he, Frankie wanted to shake his hand out of respect. Charlie said, no, I'm here to win. You're only here for two things, pay, cash and paychecks and winning championships. I heard that from some wise man I once knew. Well... The two men lock up once again, very powerful individuals, collar and elbow tie up, and Frankie sends him down hard. Not many people are gonna match power with Frankie Flo. And these two men, of course you saw earlier that Cha Cha Charlie came out to shake Frankie's hand, instead hits him with a backstabber. Then later on, Frankie came out and he decided to give a full Nelson slam to Cha Cha Charlie as payback. What's good for the goose is good for the gander. And these two men are even right now. We've got the challenger and the champion. And the challenger, wow, well, listen to that reaction. Wow. He's got a lot wow. of fans here tonight. He is from Miami, Florida by way of the Caribbean, but he also spends some time in in Inwood, this is his hometown to some extent. 
some extent is the key word. Does he have his green card too? Oh, I'm sure he does, Vinny. Both these men have their green card. What are you talking about? You know, but Cha-Cha Charlie's been around the world. He's competed many places. It's like that song, I've been everywhere, man. That's Cha-Cha Charlie. He's been everywhere. What are you, uh, Ken Rogers or something? His country song now? Wait, like, you got to know when to hold them. Yeah. Know when to hold them. Well, this is no time for singing. This is a championship match. We've got Frankie Flo in there. His arm is being worked on by Cha-Cha Charlie. And an arm wrench there, and, and Frankie goes down. Now, oh, drops the leg. And fans, oh, his shoulders were down for a second. Now the arm bar applied. Now, fans, you will remember our last event when Frankie Flo was able to take that championship belt off from around the waist of Dan the Man, but he did it under the mask of Super Taino. Then he pulled that mask off, revealing himself as Frankie Flo, and now he is the rightful champion looking to defend against Charlie. And a nice Japanese-style arm drag there. Cha-Cha Charlie rolling to the corner looking for some separation. Was it a surprise to you, Vinny, when Frankie took off that super Taino mask revealing himself? Ace, I wasn't that shocked since The Undertaker lost. I was, the last time I was shocked is, is when I realized you were that smart. I realized when you could read. That's how shocked I was. Oh, well, uh, I don't know if that's an insult or just an observation. But either way, Cha-Cha Charlie with the headlock applied, side headlock. To Frankie Flo again working on the arm is Cha Cha. Two men who are very similar in style, very similar in build. I think Frankie may have the power advantage because he is a beast of a man. The Puerto Rican beast is the nickname for a reason. And Cha Cha, Cha Cha, very strong as well. Great technical wrestling here. There's the arm. Armbar still on, working on that arm of Frankie Flo. Now, you've got to remember that Frankie is extremely powerful, has very large muscles, but you also need oxygen to get to all those muscles. So, Cha Cha, I believe his strategy may be to wear him down. You know what I need right now? H2O. Yeah, 92 degrees here tonight in Inwood, California. All the LAW wrestlers putting on the show for all these fans here tonight in sweltering weather. You know what? I kind of like Frankie now. I respect him now. Oh, you do? Well, that's I great. See in the light. Now, wait a second. I think you just like him because the fans are booing him. Oh. It, oh, I was about to say because he doesn't dance around, but you know what? It's a love-hate relationship. Well, Cha-Cha Charlie, of course, has more fans here because this is his hometown, or at least one of his hometowns. And Frankie Flo, Frankie Flo, oh, look at this, the foot on the throat of Cha-Cha. I don't know, maybe you're right, Vinny. Maybe this is a new side of Frankie Flo that we have not seen before. A new side, this is clever. This is genius right here. Finally, the beast is awakened. Well, it has yet to be determined if he will retain that title. Oh, hard back elbow there. The power of Frankie Flo. And he said he's making it look easy here. You know, a guy like Frankie Flo, he can afford to slow the pace of the match down and still be in control, dropping the elbow to the heart of Cha-Cha Charlie. You know, I got to agree with him there, Ace. It makes it look easy. It's like wiping her ass. You do it once, you know how to do it again. Do you only wipe your ass one time, Vinny? I won't get into that. Another hard elbow from Frankie Flo. Goes for the cover. Two and only two. Very close. Cha-Cha Charlie able to kick out. These fans here in Inwood rallying behind Cha-Cha Charlie. Frankie punches him right in the dome. And another hard shot. Frankie Flo looking to retain his title. Irish whip and a reversal. And a spine buster from Cha Cha Charlie. He had now, that in him? Oh, God. Firing up, perhaps a second wind for him. 
dancing away once again. You know what? I gotta admit, he, he has some, some tools in his box. I'm not aware. Wow, that was impressive. Dropping the elbow is Chacha. Two and only two. Almost a new champion, but it was only a two count, Master Higante says. Got to give credit to Master G as well. He worked every match here tonight in this very hot weather. And big fight feel, of course, here in Inwood. Cha-Cha Charlie could be looking to win the title right here. That looks like molestation. Suplex. And once again, hooks the leg two and only two. Getting the shoulder up just barely is Frankie Flo. Cha-Cha Charlie getting these fans to rally behind him once again. A lot of heart and tenacity from Frankie Flo able to kick out of all these offensive maneuvers. And that one knocks him down once again. He tumbles over backwards. And Cha-Cha says, that's it. Calling for the end. Fans, you know what? I think they're a cult. I don't know. I, I think they're like one of those that go in the camps and like cut their arms and dance with him whenever you want to dance. And, and drink the Kool-Aid? Yes. Yes. Well, we'll see. We'll see if he wins here tonight. I'm sure they'll be celebrating. Oh, but there's a stunner. Just knocking the jaw of Cha-Cha Charlie, perhaps out of position. Frankie Flo once again in control of this match. Got to admit, Look, Frank has been doing this a long time. He's a veteran. He he knows how to carry his own weight in the ring. And, and meanwhile, Charlie's up. Cha Cha Charlie. He's an up and comer. But you know, what? I give him credit. He's climbing that ladder really fast. Oh, for sure, Vinny. That was one of the issues they had earlier on tonight. Is that Frankie thought that this rookie or uh, rookie in comparison to him shouldn't even get. Oh, there's the Evelyn. Shouldn't even get a tag uh, championship shot. But oh, there's a hard clothesline. Sends Cha Cha Charlie inside out. Yeah. I think Chacha Charlie's starting to regret this decision. Well, there's a two, and only what? a two count says Master G barely gets the shoulder up, does Chacha Charlie. Wow. These, these two men just are warriors in there, fighting to the bitter end, ducking under the clothesline. Oh, and both men are down. And a lot of pain. Whoa. Master Agante starts the count. Count of one. Maybe Frankie is realizing, you know what? This guy is near my level. I respect this guy. Hey. And it looks like they're gonna get up. They're both up. Frankie catching him once again with that full Nelson slam. That's the move that knocked Cha Cha down earlier. Oh, and look at this. What? Look at this, oh. Eric Jaden. And Naya Kennedy, Naya once again distracting Master G, the ref, and, and Frankie Flo being attacked by Eric Jaden, putting the boots to him. And who's this other guy? I don't know one of Jaden's minions. Oh, this is despicable. Thank you, Eric. Thank you. Eric Jaden setting Frankie Flo up. And a leg drop from the second rope from this individual. We've never seen him before. Meanwhile, Master Higante, the referee, still distracted by the Queen Heel, Naya Kennedy. Get her out of here. Hey, look, he's a Super Saiyan. He can do what he wants. He's out of freaking Jaden. 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 Oh, and Cha Cha Charlie with the backstabber. Frankie Flo down after Jaden's interference goes for the cover. What? Two and new heavyweight champion. Oh, oh my God. Done. Thank you, Eric. Thank you. Thank you, Eric. Thank you. Shout out, Charlie. I take back what I say. You're great. I like you now. Now, what is going on here, Eric? Eric Jaden. Eric Jaden taking the mic. 
Nia Kennedy, these guys with their friend over there, they interfered in the match, giving Cha-Cha Charlie the advantage. He takes advantage and he gets the win. He's the new champion. Has Cha-Cha Charlie aligned with Eric Jaden? Thank you. Jaden calling Frankie Flo a piece of crap. Well, he did help him. Oh, but Eric Jaden, oh, hard DDT sends Cha-Cha Charlie down. Eric Jaden making a statement. You can never trust Eric Jaden. What is wrong with this guy? He helps, he helps Cha-Cha Charlie win the belt, and then he turns on him, dropping it on his head. Eric Jaden is a disgusting individual. Finally, got the fresh air. Well, what a shame that such a great contest had to end like that. Thank you, Eric. Frankie Flo attacked by Eric Jaden. He still wants that belt. He feels like he was unfairly attacked and Well, both of these men were attacked by Eric Jaden. A nice show of class there from Frankie Flo passing up the torch, giving that World Heavyweight Championship belt to Cha-Cha Charlie. Well, there he is, the new heavyweight champion. Frankie Flo, very classy guy. did indeed interfere. Ultimately, he is the reason, Eric Jaden is the reason why Cha-Cha Charlie is champion, but I'm sure Frankie's gonna want revenge. I'm sure Cha-Cha Charlie's gonna want revenge. And Eric Jaden, you better watch your back. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for watching Legendary Action Wrestling. This is La Guerra Isqueania. Once again, I am the Ace Dante Jace along with Vinny Bada Boom. For all of us here at Legendary Action Wrestling, good night, everybody!